Hello. I would like to express my sincere thanks to all subscribers for your ongoing support of my channel. For individuals who have not yet subscribed, it would be very appreciated if you could express your appreciation for liking, share this video and consider subscribing to my channel. In this video, I will teach you how to do the manual calculation to determine the required mooring capacity for the barge. We will determine the maximum forces incurred in the mooring line, due to external forces. In the event that the mooring line lacks of sufficient strength to maintain the barge in its intended position. External forces can cause tilting or in the most severe circumstances, result in the rupture of the mooring line. This is the external forces or load that affecting in mooring line. Wind load. Wave drift load. Tidal current load. For this calculation, we will use 230 feet barge with length of 70.1 meter, width is 19.5 meter and depth is 4.27 meter. Let's consider the barge draft is 2 meter, and the barge freeboard is 2.27 meter. Next, on top of the barge, we have a 90 ton cargo with length of 8 meter, width of 5.5 meter and height is 6.5 meter. Now, let's calculate the barge freeboard area. To get the barge freeboard area, multiply the barge overall length to freeboard height. Next, calculate the submerged lateral area of barge. Multiply the barge overall length to barge draft. For easy calculation, I consider the barge's rectangle surface. I separate this calculation into two video. For our calculation, this is the design criteria we consider. Wind velocity pressure is 93 Newton per meter squared. Wave height is 0.5 meter. Tidal current velocity is 0.5 meter per second. For mooring analysis, let's consider two cases. Case number one. Forces acting on the left hand side of the barge or port side. Due to external forces acting on the barge, it will cause the barge to move or tilt. We need to calculate the moment forces. Case number 2. Forces acting on the right hand side of the barge or starboard side. I consider in this scenario the distance for both mooring point is different. To be continue in my next video.